What is up, everybody? It is Sunday. It has been a long week. We've been staying out late with some friends. Today, we are freaking exhausted. The bus is a disaster. <laughs> we did a workout yesterday. I know we didn't show it to you, but it was brutal. Like, it was a super good workout, but we are so tired. Like, our bodies are just drained so we didn't show it because it wasn't our warehouse that we did it at it wasn't our right to be able to show it so with that um we apologize for that but sometimes we run into them type of things and we respect the people that we run around so with that today is gonna probably be not very much uh, we plan to obviously clean up the bus and stuff, but our buddy that came in yesterday is leaving this morning So we're gonna go hang out with him for a little bit and then We will clean the bus up make some food do the thing and bring you guys along. So let's go. We are back We said our goodbyes And now the work begins because this I know Dustin showed you unacceptable very very unacceptable so we're gonna get to clean it we get started So, we're all cleaned up. <laughs> and it's a lot better feeling. Yes. So, yes we do often put stuff in our sink to ride so that we can travel to where we're headed and things aren't flying off the, off the countertops and things like that. So we currently are ready to move now. So, we're gonna head down the road Find a spot. Set up for the day <laughs> and probably cook some lunch. Yes, we have I'm not ate yet. Hungry. So let's go. All right, guys, we are pretty much set up where we're going to be for the day. And since we have not ate yet, now's going to be a good time to fire some food up. So let's do it. guys so avocado sourdough toast with some garlic salt I got sweet potatoes carrots broccoli onion and purple cabbage all diced up with two burgers all fried up and then I fried up three eggs each and that my friends is lunch and I'm about to dig in all right we are all done with lunch or brunch or whatever you want to call it I could not eat all of my food, so I just put it in a little Tupperware container. That way I can maybe eat it later. 
Um, and usually since Dustin is the one that cooks, I try to be nice and do the dishes. That way it's kind of like doing the whole double duty thing. If he cooks, I do the dishes or vice versa. It's just kind of another way to help each other out. Um, that way one's not always doing all of the work. So that's what I'm gonna get to doing. So as you've seen that we got done eating and Tanya cleaned the house up, I read and meditated. Um, it's something that I try to do on the daily and I need to start focusing more on it. So I made it happen today and that's the only way we grow is to make things happen. While I do that or did that, Tanya started editing yesterday's video. And yes, every day she edits some form of video or another. And that is how we put out a daily vlog for you. So if you appreciate it, leave us a thumbs up. Leave us a comment in the video section below so that we know you guys appreciate what we are doing for you. And for us, we're all growing and learning together. With that, I'm going to see how much time she has to go and I might go for a quick walk. Now that I am all woke up, I am going to actually plan my week out. So I'm gonna plan what I have to do for business, what I have to do for workouts, what I have to do for food, all them things. I'm gonna plan my entire week out, all the posts, all the videos, all the things. So, let's get started. Well, we got some work done. And now we're going to take a little break to go on a walk. Um, just to get some movement in for all of us. And I think this will be our first walk of the day. So, let's get ready to roll. <gasps> Journey. Journey. Can I scoot over and sit here? Huh? You gonna make room for me? You gonna make room for me? Put your little harness on. Can you bring me a little, I don't know, I guess I don't need a jacket. No, we're gonna walk. Like last night. Yeah. No, I mean, it's. it might be a little chilly, but I think by the time we're done. Who's this? What's this? She's like, I don't know. That's the thing I get off all the time. I don't care for it. Ain't that sweet? I can get out of it. <laughs> There's one arm. There's two arms. And a nose. And a nose. Journey girl excited. <laughs> Says, Come on, Dad. Come on.
We are back from our walk. Little Journey is exhausted. What are you doing? I am about to get back to work. What are you working on? I need to plan my week. So, I'm gonna drop my phone. I write down in my notes book what my week's gonna look like, how I'm going to tackle it, everything I need to do so that way I can be nice and productive and get shit done. That's what I got going on. I am gonna do some research on some vlogs and some things like that to see how we can better spread love and value to you guys. If you guys have any ideas, please let us know. If there's a video you would like us to do, please let us know. Um, again, we got done with our first walk. Journey's out cold. Probably start dinner here before too long, but for now, we're gonna do some research. And sometimes when you're working, and your girl wants up on your lap, you just gotta take a break and hold her the way she wants and play with her because it's not always about working more or doing more or having more. Sometimes it's just about appreciating what you have and loving life. She is a real treat. All right, I just got a bunch of video ideas for you guys. We are super excited. I got journey up on the bed journey what do you have to say huh what do you have to say she wants to kiss you guys as tanya tears the table down hi y'all why are you tearing the table down um to make more room um because i'm done working at the table and dustin's gonna go make us some dinner and then that way there's just a little bit less stuff in the way for right now so that was actually why i turned the camera on um working the two of us uh oftentimes it's one has to move over here while the other one does this and the other one does that so communication is key for us to not only keep level-headed but it's easy to get into an argument like oh what are you doing here what's going on there like it's it's simple because we both are living in a tiny space so how do we make that work communication letting each other know what we're up to how we can best help each other and then we add in journey to where she needs to eat and she needs to drink and her kennel and it's a lot of things going on so honestly pure correct communication and stating exactly what we need to do for each other as well as for ourselves is basically how we survive every day. I am gonna start cooking us some din din. What are we having tonight? Freaking pizza, baby! All right, so I have the oven preheating to 400 degrees. I have some morning star chorizo, some yellow pepper, some purple cabbage, and an onion in there. And then for our pizza crust, we just bought a crust, but for the sauce, we actually use Sabra. So it's gonna be like a taco pizza. I might throw some black beans at it yet. Um, do have some avocados, maybe I'm gonna do that. But yeah, just kind of playing it by ear, but frying everything up right now, and then we will cook it all on top of the pizza and see how it turns out. When your baby girl is so tired. She finds her way on her daddy's foot. <laughs> Journey girl, what are you doing? Are you cozy? Oh, the joys of having a little pup. All right, the pizza's completely put together. Look at that. It looks freaking delicious. Now we throw it in the oven. Pizza is finito. Man, does that look delicious. Little girl made it to her kennel. Tanya's still busting it. Now what? It's time to eat. We feast. All right, guys. So, we, we just got back from our <laughs> second walk. <laughs> it was going to 
to say. We finished eating. We went on a walk. And the pizza was delicious. It was bomb. Our battery is dying. Our day is ending. Oh, and God. with that, we thank you. We appreciate you. We love you. We love you. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow.